Hello guys, today I want to quickly show you one package called Laravel Model JSON and the author of the package, Vildan, emailed me showing this package and we had a short email conversation. I was asking him what is the use case for that package because personally to me, I don't remember exporting or importing into JSON format. For example, you want to export that JSON of particular database table into your local system, then give that JSON file to somewhere else, some other developer, or maybe some external system to import it back. I used to do that all the time in SQL or CSV. I didn't think it could be done with JSON, but that package allows you to do that if you prefer this format. So I've tried it out, it works. So all you need to do is just export the model and let's see how it works. So for example, I have a database table of posts with just one post. In Composer JSON, I've installed that package of model JSON and then we do PHP Artisan model export post like this. Your model JSON is saved to project storage. I'm not entirely sure about the file name because the file name is compiled with backslashes and with my forward slashes, I will show you what it becomes. My PHP storm for some reason doesn't show the file doesn't want to refresh. So I will show you that with commander. This is the JSON file. So if we open it up in sublime text, it looks like this. So a typical JSON with all the fields. And also I tried the other way around. So in my PHP storm, I have post JSON to import with just the title. Remember in the database, we have ID and timestamps, which should be automatic. Will it automatically import those? Let's try it out. According to the documentation of the package, there's import with parameters, model import, and then public user JSON. Let's actually copy that into my terminal. Let's clear the terminal, paste it, model import post model to it's not public it's just storage app posts json although i need to provide the full path i guess storage app posts json like this let's try it out your json data has been successfully inserted cool let's refresh the database we refresh and we do have that new post with automatic timestamps and id so the package works. That's the most simple usage. You can read more in the readme of the package and just shoot in the comments below. I'm just genuinely curious if any of you would actually prefer JSON for that import and export. As I said earlier, I prefer SQL inserts or CSV files, but why would you use JSON? Let's discuss in the comments below. As always, I encourage you to subscribe to this channel because I keep shooting daily video while I have energy and the topics and see you guys in those other videos.